And so the red team will inbound a minute and 11 seconds remaining in the first half. They lead 28 to 10. Here's Harold Hack just came back into the game a few moments ago. Pass was intended for Liddy, but it was poked away. Ball to the floor. Pone grabs it. Hack taking his time, lobs it up to Pone. One-handed, keeps it over the heads of the defenders. No good. Rebound poked away, and it's Steve O'Brien who comes up with it. Pone just couldn't quite get his chair squared on that one. Took away the backboard from him. 28 to 10, the red team leads. Here's Joanne Rodriguez, gets it to drop. First field goal in a long time for the white team. Makes the score 28 to 10 with under 30 seconds remaining. White team pulling out a little bit of a half court press. They decide to pull up now. We're down to 17 seconds. Here's De Leon, lobs it over to Colson. Colson dishes inside to Liddy, puts it up, no good, doesn't drop. Good look that time, but the shot didn't go after a great pass. See if White's aware that there's just five seconds on the clock. Down to three seconds, here's Rodriguez. One second remaining, she decides not to put up a shot, and that will end the first half. It's been all red team so far in this one, thanks to the efforts of the big man, Anthony Pone, the speed of Orlando Perez, and the good looks of Jeff DeLeon. 28 to 12 is our score as we head to halftime. Stick around, we'll be back with second half action, red team versus the white team. Wheelchair basketball presented by HP. You're watching the National Veterans Wheelchair Games here on xable.com. <laughs> 